What's going on everybody? I'm back with another one. I know that last video was crazy long. I think it was almost like 20 minutes. So I'm gonna try to chop it up. It was just so much going on that day. I was just, I wanted just to show everything. I was like, damn, this video is 20 minutes, but I'm gonna shorten it up or probably start breaking it into maybe two videos. If I am doing a vlog and it's gonna be long like that, I'll probably do like two videos and just drop them on the same day. Maybe just to get, or back to back, like Monday, Tuesday, something like that. This so we can break it up a little bit because I'm like, I know nobody wants to see my fat face for 20 minutes. So I'll make sure I'll change a few things with that. So another day about to get started. Well, it's been started, but I started the camera at this time. And same routine we'd have, we'd have like the mastermind group. These are my friends, these are my brothers, but they're all professionals in their own lane and then when we come together we're able to produce you know these crazy ideas and not only produce crazy ideas but to actually start putting action behind it because what is an idea if you don't put action behind it it's pretty much just bs so starting today with my 300 milligrams of caffeine probably gonna take it up to four this is 100 right here i put two of those liquid iv energy packs so that's 300, I'll finish this before I even go upstairs into the office. And yeah, it's 300 milligrams every time. And yeah, that's that's light work. We're probably gonna take it up to at least 800 before this day is over. Cause I see a couple of energy drinks that got my name on it. But other than that, we're gonna keep it rocking and rolling. Um, we're gonna go to the gym after I have like the meeting and all that is said and done. I was gonna try to go right now, but if I leave now, I'm going to be racing, trying to get everything done at the gym. And it's not going to be the best workout because I got a lot of cardio to do today. And I still need to hit back a ton of deadlifts, about an hour cardio. So I figured once everybody comes over, we uh, do what we need to do. I'll go after so then I can really have time to just lock in, focus, train. And now this also gives me a good time for me to, if I drop this video or not, I'll work on edit this video, get this out, do a couple of other things around here, and yeah, get back to it. But yeah, it's time to get super, super lean. I know usually it's like the winter time. Most people tend to take this time to put on the size and get, get a little fluffy, but I'm going to Hawaii soon, so I gotta make sure it's looking Make sure it's looking on point. So nothing crazy. Have all this extra these snacks. Got some milk cookies here. I can't even eat, so I'll probably give it to them at some point when they come over. And that is what it's looking like. I'm sure things are gonna get crazy again, even though today's a Sunday. And I'm sure I'm gonna have to pivot and do some other things. But for now, that's technically the game plan and what I want to do. It's kind of cool, right? It's like. You know, if, if you've seen Theraguns, right, they made like this ball, so where it's a solid ball, but then if you hold it, it starts to vibrate. And, right? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that, right? So you could just throw this in your car, throw this in your gym bag, and now you have like a real massage ball that's pretty powerful like it was already good anyone who's doing any sort of like mobility work or trying to stretch or trying to open up uh that scar tissue or open up your hips and lower back you could usually just get like a tennis ball or a baseball put it under there it does the trick but now adding this little vibration this little massage action to it i honestly think it is worth it so if you see it i would highly recommend it it is called wave solo i think i had the box somewhere but i can't find it but it's called wave solo take a look so if you need something there to like loosen up before you get started where you're doing jujitsu uh hitting the weights whatever i'd recommend it definitely not a paid sponsorship but i would like it to be at some point so wave solo stop playing let's get let's talk some numbers but um all right rambling let me put in my water bottle can't even see it, but all right. Anyway, that's what's going on. I'm gonna finish my coffee. And that was sugar-free cream, if you didn't see, by the way. I remember somebody saw me drinking like a soda one time. And mind you, like diet soda isn't the greatest, but it wasn't a real soda. It was like a diet Mountain Dew. Get off of me. And if I want to have a, a real Mountain Dew, I can have a Mountain Dew. I, can, I think I'm entitled to have a Mountain Dew every blue moon, but I don't. 
and I don't even really drink soda, period. And my creamer is only when I'm drinking my little coffee in the morning because I like creamer. All right, I'm definitely rambling. Um, let's get started. Finish my coffee, finish my, my water with my two packs of uh, liquid IV. That's another thing, if you, have, if you haven't already, if you already use liquid IV, go check out their energy one. It definitely works. You can just throw a ton of packs in the gym bag. I'm all about being mo mobile and just have everything like, I'm all about the portability. So you can throw a couple of packs in there and now you just have it at the gym or your job, wherever you're at, and you can just pop it, shake it up. It doesn't taste too bad. It's like a lemon ginger kind of flavor and it's all good. So, all right, finish all this stuff up. Gonna head upstairs, power everything up, get ready for these guys, try to knock out some things before they come, and let's get started. Long chain. Um, well, let, me start, let me scratch that off. All right, guys, it's time to get to work. Three different ideas to bring to the table. Okay. The one thing that has been extraordinarily in the business to solve is seed. Okay. But you're thinking more of like a software that you could have them buy and implement into their business. Or subscribe from us. Yeah. Because I, I guess a, a decentralized application would be available for the for anybody, for the whole, you know. Are you, is that something that you're not wanting? Do you not want it to be like a public, you know, blockchain? Or do you want it to be like something that you just give to them, you sell it as a service? Right. So that's where it gets. I I have no clue. Like yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll figure that out. <laughs> we'll figure that out. It's it's not rocket science. Yeah, it's not rocket science. It's just checks and balances, man. How do we build those checks and balances using the blockchain? Can the blockchain build those checks and balances? For, for example, you you log into the system. Let's say you're the payables person, mm -hmm. or let's let's say I'm the payables person. What is going on, everyone? All right, back again. Dang, I couldn't really post as much as I wanted to and with that meeting. I was like, all right, I wanted to show show it, show you guys what we were talking about. But we really started getting into detail with a lot of plans and a lot of things that we have in the works. So that's why I had to cut it short. But it definitely went well. I'm big on this mastermind group. One of the biggest, biggest things I overcame was learning like, okay, I cannot do all of this by myself. It used to be a real big problem of mine where it's like, I would just wear all the hats. I do it all myself. I'm not. I don't want to put it, put anyone in position with it. Let me. It doesn't work like that. Especially if you want to scale your business. If you really want to have, not only be self-employed, but be able to have your time back. Because when I was trying to do everything by myself, I was spending more time doing all these different things as opposed to having more time to do maybe certain things that I prefer or love to do. And I realized like, okay. I can't, this isn't sus sustainable, this isn't going to work. So bringing everyone in and everyone has their own unique strengths and whatever weaknesses that we may have, someone else can pick up the slack in that. And I really was able to see that today, just to see how everybody was just bringing up their strengths to the table. And I, I was like, and I wanted to, trust me, I wanted to definitely show it, but it was one of those things where what we started to talk about, it's like, eh, I really don't think these guys would want to have that posted let's just keep it in-house and when things really start coming to fruition we definitely start posting it and like showing it but at least one of you got like a snippet of what's going on but everybody was in the building uh great call really really ramping up this idea of businesses within the blockchain within crypto with, within these nfts and it's becoming like a real way to diversify your port portfolio in these investments and then also creating businesses in it so very very cool i'm excited it's gonna be a lot of work i already see it's gonna be a ridiculous amount of work but that's what i love about it like if it was easy i don't know i probably wouldn't be as motivated because i would see it as like okay if it's this easy then okay it's gonna come crumbling down soon with the amount of time that's gonna be required in it the, in the investment that you have to put into it you know i hold it a little bit more close to my heart because i really truly made a real decision and sacrifice to put time and energy into it like these little quick schemes that okay you can make a, a quick hustle real quick short-lived right it doesn't have longevity in it right and i used to be like that i used to just always look for like the quick scheme and the quick hustle the quick flip and it's like eh, all right let's really do it for me when i have like 
the journey of it. The journey is more inspiring to me. I enjoy the journey more than actually re than actually reaching the end result. When I get to the end result, I'm already looking at it. Okay, what what can we start next? But that's always been my personality. It's like I've got to have multiple like lanes going at the same time. Like my brain is just crazy like that. I want to have multiple lanes going, and I want to just be blah, 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 with the team blah, 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 with it. You know, so went good. And that's the, the beauty of also having a team. And that was a problem I used to have back in the day where I, I would just try to do all the work by myself. And that's not the way to do it, especially if you're really trying to scale and really try to grow something. Like, you can't do everything by yourself. Even down to the videos, it's like, sometimes I have to, you know, hey, you hold the camera. Like, you rock with this. So having the team, that's awesome. And yeah, we got some more things coming. So more updates, more videos, more vlogs. Um, probably gonna do these vlogs more often I like them and we're gonna have the regular videos of course but we're gonna have everything on this channel like we're all it's, we're putting it all on here put it like that so alright more videos on the way let's get to it peace